Hi guys, in this video I just wanted to really briefly show you this program, the open source program that I'm using now in place of SPSS. So if you're a big user of SPSS and you're having troubles with uh, licensing or you just don't want to pay for the license anymore and you want a good alternative which is minimally different, in other words quite similar to SPSS, well there is a good alternative called PSPP and this is what I'm showing on the screen right now. I'm actually uh, been using it for a short time now and I find that it's not too different than SPSS and it's absolutely free and plenty of uh, helpful uh, documentation and uh, uh, tool packs for it are available. So I'll just run through the menu system and give you some visuals as I'm, as I'm chatting right now so that you may get an idea, maybe try it out for yourself. So we have all descriptive statistics, compare means, we got ANOVAs, t-tests, all that kind of bivariate correlation, k-mean clusters, factor analysis, reliability, regression, non-parametric methods, and ROC curves. This is the this, these come stock. You have quite a bit of utilities. Everything else is quite similar to SPSS. You have the variable view here, and you have the data view here. Okay, so be sure to check out some of my tutorial videos in Excel, Access, PowerPoint, Statistics, Math, and R. I'm actually a bigger fan of R than any of the other packages, but I do recognize the uh, ease of use of SPSS, so I thought it might be wise to turn people on to PSPP. So, hope you enjoyed my video, subscribe to my channel, and click on our sponsors ads, keep these videos coming to you for free. Till next time, have a great day.